Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Lisa, Best Life Lee. Today I'm gonna to be doing a what's in my bag video with my summer essentials. And today I have this cute, this cute, cute, cute little crossbody that I got from Amazon. And I'm going to share with you uh, what this bag looks like and what this bag, what I have in this bag to carry with me wherever I go this summer. Um, so it is a faux leather bag. This is not a real leather bag, but you can see that it has the most cute B on it. And uh, it's called Aluda Pijou, classic something, I don't know. Um, so yeah, this is uh, the cutest. You can carry it like this, or you can make it a crossbody. And I actually, you can make the strap a little bit longer, um, but I kind of like it right here. It's almost like, you know, at waist level. So why the B? So this is obviously not a designer bag. It's not a Gucci, it's not a Louis Vuitton. It's not a Burberry, I wish it were, but it doesn't matter because uh, no, I just think it's the cutest little bag. This is from Amazon and this bag, believe it or not, if you look at it, the gold tone hardware, um, it, it's a soft, like faux leather. This bag is $23.99. So, and it comes in about seven times Let's six see. is 42, 42 colors. Um, and you know, so at $23, you can get a couple of these to mix and match with your outfits. But anyway, so the significance of bees. So if you've noticed, I've noticed that bees are on a lot of different fashion things from bags to clothing, to all kinds of different uh, fashion things. And um, so I did a little bit of research on why bees are so popular right now. And they actually became uh, popular in 2019 when Gucci put a bee on one of their bags. Uh, and then of course everybody was trying to follow suit. In September of 2020, in the Paris runway, they did uh, all about bees or all about the garden and then they had bee kind of related um, clothing like even beekeeper masks, which you will not catch me wearing anytime soon. But uh, anyway, so bees, and you know, because we were in such a global pandemic for uh, over a year, I think the more we start to think about our ecological systems and protecting them, you're going to see that kind of thing where, you know, we're celebrating things like the bee. And without the bee, we have no ecological systems because they pollinate and, um, keep things going. So I have no problem celebrating the bee. <laughs> and so I'm going to show you what's in my bag. I have been able to really put quite a bit of stuff in this bag. So if you want to see what I have in this bag, then just keep on watching. All right. So first of all, I'm going to start. This has three good size pockets in this bag. So I'm going to start at the back and what I have in this back pocket is my phone and I just have to show you my phone case. Um, this is just a lovely phone case. I wanted something that was white with a gold trim. Uh, it's kind of a rose gold trim and this little uh, pearl handle on the back. I can carry my phone around like this. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, it looks completely designer, um, but it was $9.98. <laughs> so you can get just a gorgeous uh, phone case from Amazon, and it probably needs to be cleaned, but um, for $9.98, hey, you know what? 
I look designer. I've been getting a lot of compliments on this phone case. But anyways, this last pocket here, this one on the end, my sunglasses. And these are the sunnies that I got from the B-Style box, my April B-Style box. So these are awesome. I'm loving those. And the other little thing I have in here, this is some hand cream that I got from a uh, samples from Ulta last year. And this just um, smells incredible. This is um, Cela. This is Creme de la Creme, Creme de la Creme. Um, the very best cream and this smells like um, I'll show you this smells like an orange creamsicle this is just divine <laughs> and I haven't gotten around to picking up a, a um, full size but I definitely will but to carry in your purse it's awesome so I still have room in this back section, but because I have my phone in here and my glasses, I really don't want to overstuff that pocket, um, but perfect. And then in the middle pocket, um, I have my wallet. And this, my friends, is another B little card carrier this is from Amazon as well this is actually a leather card wallet and it is RFID which means nobody can scan anything and get your card information it has a little removable little keychain and basically my keychain has this little hooky thing on it so I don't have to take everything when I want to drive, I don't have to have this hanging from my, you know, my um, ignition in my car. So, but I can hook it right on there and at least I know where my keys are in my purse. But this little card wallet is leather and you know how much this was? This was $12.99 and this comes in five different colors. This comes in like a light blue, a purple, a light pink, and a red, and a black. And it carries all my cards, my, my license. Um, you know, I could even fit some bills in here if I had them, um, to, you know. So I love this little purse, this little card wallet, and my little keychain. And this is a must-have in the summer this is my TIGI bed head this is a hair stick um, for cool people <laughs> but the reason why I have this hair stick and this is like you push up from the bottom and it's like a little um, wax sort of um, stick it is a stick and like when you're out in the summertime, whether it's the beach or whether you're taking a ferry boat ride or whether you're just out al fresco, I like to wear my hair up when I'm in the summertime. I like to get it off my face, especially if I'm going to be in a windy time. There's nothing I hate more than all the little wispies that sort of start sticking out. And this little wax stick will help you to just kind of wax those back into place and just get yourself so that you don't have all those wispies um, and you just push it back in. Um, this is just really, really great. I love well. this. So this I... is definitely a summer essential in my purse. I also have this little um, Slay All Day setting spray from Gerard Cosmetics. Um, this is just something and this is a, uh, I got this in a B-style box uh, one summer. And this is green uh, tea ginger. and ginger. Sometimes you just need to refresh because you are sweating or, you know, you've been out in the hot sun and you just need something to spritz. And so any kind of little small um, setting spray, like you can get any kind of these from like the little... Um, sample sections of the store. Of course I have to have my pen and this is erasable. I have to have an erasable pen. You just never know. 
and I have a mask in here now I do not have to wear masks anymore in my state uh, over the state of emergency so um, but I know there are still a few things, a few scenarios where a mask will be required. Hopefully I never have to go into any one of those scenarios, but I just feel like I should carry one just in case in. then I have my mask. So that is the middle compartment. And like I said, I can fit quite a bit in here. All right, and then this last compartment, I have a little kabuki brush. And you say, why do you have a travel kabuki brush? Um, so this, you just cover it up with this little um, slide up thing. Put your cover on and your brush will stay nice and clean and protected in your bag. So um, this is an e.l.f travel kabuki brush and I have this because I have a palette that has setting powder and it also has bronzer and it also has uh, a blush um, I just think having these three um, products will be um, helpful in the summertime um, I would love to be able to put some bronzer or some blush, refresh my blush, and then do a setting powder on top. And I didn't want to carry a bunch of little small things. This doesn't have room for a little cosmetic bag. So I thought that this would be the perfect little palette. You see that you have the setting powder some bronzer, some highlighter, some blush. So I really love this. And this is a pure product. And this is the fair light one. They have a fair dark one, I think, or fair medium, not sure. But this is the fair light. Yes, it's got a um, translucent powder, a bronzer, a blush, and a highlighter. So everything you need to spruce up. Like if you are going from work and you're meeting somebody or meeting friends somewhere you're going out for drinks whatever uh, going out to dinner meeting your husband whatever your significant other uh, you can just be beautiful with a little travel brush and your palette love that palette and then I have my hand sanitizer always need a hand sanitizer I think that's an excellent practice going forward I have my super glue cannot go anywhere without my super glue wouldn't want to lose a nail on my way to that al fresco dinner meeting after work um, then I have my readers if you saw my um, dollar tree haul I got these really cute glasses that just fold these are readers that just fold up and um, they're awesome. They might not be the most fashionable, but they definitely fit really, really easily into my bag. Um, and I just think that's awesome. And I also have some lens wipes in my bag um, because there's nothing worse than fingerprints all over the glasses. And I know by folding them, I'm gonna get fingerprints. So I have these. And last but not least in this bag, I wanted to, I didn't want to carry a lot of lipsticks. I wanted to just carry one essential lip lipstick. And I wanted something with SPF because if you're sitting out in the sun, um, and this has beautiful, beautiful color. Um, this is a physician's formula. It's a butter and it's a SPF 15. And this is in the color um, Pinkini. <laughs> and this is a beautiful lipstick. And um, I have on gloss right now, so I'm not going to put it on my lips. But look what, what a pretty color this is. And it's so blendable. It feels like you're putting on 
um, chapstick versus a pretty lip color. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I just have this in my purse so that, you know, after a meal, I can redo my lips or after sitting in the sun for a while I can redo my lips whatever the case may be just after driving for a while you need to refresh and I just have this one lipstick that I carry with me now in my purse so that is what's in my purse I clearly have fit quite a bit of things in this little in this little uh, crossbody bag and I think that I have not overstuffed it. It does not look overstuffed. It definitely, whoops, I forgot my little, my little wipes, my little lens cleaners. Put those right back in there. I have all my summer essentials with me. It's comfortable, it's not too heavy, even though I have everything in there. It's not bulky. I could definitely take this and I could definitely um, make this even a little bit longer, but I like this length, so I'm not gonna mess with it. But if you wanted it a little longer, you could make it a little longer. Um, and if you didn't wanna use the strap, you could just take the strap off. And now it becomes this cute, cute little bag. So yeah, this is my summer, my new summer crossbody bag, my new summer essential bag. I will be taking everywhere with me. I don't need a big bag. Um, and I am very fashionable with the B. <laughs> so yeah, um, and like I say, this, this comes in just, a ton of colors every color under the sun that you could possibly want you could get for $23.98 so I hope that you have enjoyed this video guys I hope that I have given you some inspiration I hope that I have showed you a way to get designer look for a very non designer price and um, yeah so that is going to do it for this video today. Thanks so much for stopping by. Thanks for hanging out with me and checking out what's inside my bag. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope that you will consider subscribing and I hope that you will come back. So if you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks again for watching guys. Take care. Bye for now.